Welcome back. There's still a blood supply shortage. One of the largest blood donation centers in Colorado, Vitalin, says that its donation supply for most blood types is at a two year low. Brooke Way with Vitalin joins us now. Good morning, Brooke. It's so nice to see you again. Good morning. Thanks for having me. So tell me, why are people not donating as much right now? Yeah, so we've seen um, donors not coming in as much because of several reasons. You know, the pandemic has been holding people back from coming in, as well as um, flu season and the winter weather makes it more difficult to come into centers and blood drives. So there's various factors um, that's causing people to put off donating blood um, for the for the summertime, usually. Yeah, and, and you know, the, the need is so high right now. Can you talk about that? Yeah, we're coming out of a national blood shortage, actually. We have an urgent need for all blood types, especially type O and O negatives, universal types. So we definitely need that, as well as platelets. We need all people to come in who are healthy and able to give right now to make up for the units that we lost due to uh, several canceled drives because of the pandemic. And it's very easy to give. You know, what would you say to someone who's on the fence about donating? Yeah, if you've never given blood before, I would just say give it a try. You never know how um, you might react. It would probably be a very easy process for you. So from start to finish, it's usually only about an hour to donate whole blood. You come in, you do a quick health check, and then the actual donation process is only about 10 minutes. And then we just ask you to stay and enjoy some yummy snacks afterward and regain your energy. There you go. And um, last question, Brooke, how can people uh, donate? Yeah, if you'd like to donate, go to Vitalent.org. We ask that you make an appointment right now uh, for a center or drive that's nearest you. In February's Heart Health Month, so it's a great time to check out your own health status after you donate blood. Certainly a great way to save so many lives. Brooke Way, thank you so much. Thank you.